What's going on everyone? How are you doing today? My name is The Leaping Lemur and before you get into this video, if you could please like, comment, and subscribe, that would be greatly appreciated. It really helps in the algorithm. So a couple of days ago, the moment we were all anticipating happened and Daniel Larson was finally released from jail. Now the Daniel Larson content was pretty scarce at the time, but as the time of recording, Daniel has already made new accounts. This is a common trend among Daniel Larson as he buys a new phone once he's released and he starts a whole new TikTok and YouTube page. The TikTok page is titled Daniel Larson Free 2024 and already has a large collection of Daniel Larson videos. I'll play a few for y'all now. Hello everybody, it is March 1st, 2024 and I got released from the Boulder County Jail. Hello everyone, please check out my new TikTok account. Daniel Larson Free 2024. Yesterday, after I got released from the Boulder County Jail, I bought myself a new phone with my music distribution sales income. Hey everyone, please check out my new YouTube channel called Daniel Larson Free 2024. So y'all, like he said, let's check out that YouTube page he mentioned, Daniel Larson Free 2024. And if you look at that page, it's just a collection of reposts from his TikTok. But the real juicy shit is in the comments of his shorts, as he seems a lot more active in these comments compared to his TikTok page. In these comments, people started asking Daniel about his experience in jail, and my suspicion of Daniel eating a few chocolate hot dogs was validated, as someone asked Daniel, did you get touched in jail? To which Daniel replies with a simple yes. Now, this is big news folks it's hard to say if daniel's being truthful here but i mean i don't see why he would lie about such an embarrassing thing Someone asked Daniel for further clarification, writing, Hey Daniel, I saw you replied to somebody you got touched inappropriately by your cellmate in jail. Can you go into more detail about that? This is major news, and big news is big money. Now, I'm gonna show you the censored version of Daniel's reply, but homie really said he was fully R-worded. Now, if you don't know what that means, let's just say it's a word that rhymes with great. Anyway, that's it for this episode. So far, not much has come out from Daniel besides these crazy-ass replies. So until next time, I'm the Leaping Lemur, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.